So, right now, there is a really good way in grinding right now, thanks to the new Warriors maps. Um, again, my team I'm going to be grinding is Robin. I do see, I do seriously want to make my Robin, but she already has plenty of SP. But yeah, um, Lance Fowler 3 is mostly why I'm bringing her. And in case you guys don't remember, your SP stacking skills, they stack with the WXP stuff. So, that's a good idea. Um, what I really am interested in is getting my Effie up. I gonna, I'm going to give her Brave Lance Plus. And probably Gale Force. So, it's going to take uh, quite a bit of time before we get there. Uh, that's a bad Effie, by the way. I, I just, I'm going to be seriously, going to be serious about Effie when I find a 4-star one proper IVs and make it a 5-star to um, clean that one up. Alright, Axe Fowler. Uh, as usual, Axe Fowler is pretty simple. Um, 2x, yes, 2x SP. This is why you wanted the Summer Heroes, because they both had, they had Axe Fowler and Lance Fowler, which really helps out with your, you know, grinding stuff. That's also why I'm trying to suggest to you guys to save up your orbs and wait for um, Halloween Banner. The Halloween Banner is probably going to have more Valor stuff. And that's probably gonna help you a lot because every single um, seasonal banner so far seems to have like these Axie XP. Like uh, here's Chrom. Chrom has Axe Valor, uh, sorry Axe Experience, which is WXP. Anyways, this stuff really helps out with training and things. It saves you a ton of time. But what I'm more serious about is trying to get Anna up. I'm gonna give Anna Blazing Flame. I usually have A for Anna as Fury, but I removed it in this case because um, it's really hard to grind when you're constantly losing HP. Anyways, um, the, here's the fun part about all the Warriors maps. So just do the hard version, right, for for the SP. But that would mean this is usually the best one to do, which is um, part five hard for SP grinding. I think part four hard also works, but uh, for my experience, it's part five Warriors. And even though you've already done it, there's no penalty drop for SP gain. Which is really, really strange. No penalty drop for SP or EXP gain. So, technically, this is the best way to train, but particularly best way to SP gain. Uh, SP train. SP grind. Alright. I really like this because it keeps the it keeps green separated, it keeps red separated. So all I have to do is toss my Effie up there and I'll, I'll be fine. But yeah, this is um just basic SP grinding right now. I can't believe they did this. I think they're just trying to, like imitate uh, how um, real Fire Emblem Warriors is going to be like, which is you going up against a ton of shitty enemies for SP. Uh, for I don't even know. Do you guys even like Musou games? That's what the kind of games are called when you fight a bunch of AI, essentially. Uh, shitty AI constantly. But yeah, I'm going to do this for a bit. It's basically just to get um, SP for my new heroes. Well, not new heroes. Well, heroes I'm gonna, I'm semi semi serious about, but you know, I haven't had much of a chance to use yet. I really like, I really like how they split this off. Reds all in this corner, blues here, greens here, which makes it really easier, yes. just easy, just to use my green here, my green hero here. Hype for Black Knight, yeah, Black Knight tomorrow. Oh my, obviously gonna stream tomorrow, guys. Um, just talking about my. Talking about my schedule going forward, it's going to be pretty simple. It's going to be... It's going to be weekends for Fire Emblem Heroes. I want to do more Fire Emblem Heroes streams. Uh, no, 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 less Fire Emblem Heroes streams, but more impactful Fire Emblem Heroes streams. The thing is, like, I think I have so many streams that people, like, take it for granted and they just don't go along. Like, don't come and watch. And I think it's because I spread the content so thin that people do that because, um... I'm not providing it uh, as much fun, so uh, the plan for me is to split things up to split things up so it's um, arena and arena arena and hero review and then arena assault and hero review. That's going to be the two bases of this stream going forward. But yeah, but things for like tomorrow for the Black Knight, I'm definitely going to just um, for tomorrow. It's definitely just going to be simple. It's just going to be Black Knight, Arena, and probably Hero View, a bit of Hero View. Not, not too much. Anyways, yeah, this is a really great, great way for getting SP, guys. You can do this as many times as you want, and it's actually more efficient than anything else in the game right now. Because of, um... Because it's only 10, 10 SP, and you seem to be fighting, like, what? Um, 30 enemies? If you do the map, if you do the map, for the best... For the absolute best grinding right now, which is in chain challenges, it's actually not as good as this is. Because uh, in the best chain challenge maps, you'll get like 100, 100 enemies. 
Um, but for this, you get like what, about 30 something, and then you, it's only 10 SP. I mean, sorry, 10 um, 10 stamina. So it's pretty easy to get to do, and get SP for. So yeah, that's about it. Pretty easy stuff for SP, and you can repeat as many times as you want. Uh, forgot how many, forgot how many turns there are. Turn 11, there was still a spawn. Hmm. Maybe I should have tested it more. But anyways, yeah, plenty of SP. It's also good for merit. If you guys are, if you guys are need to grind SP right now, just do this. 10 stamina for 150 SP nim. Yeah, 10 for 150. That's cre That's incredible. Or 25 enemies. Yeah. Well, 150. That's better than chain challenges right now. But yeah, it's it's pretty amazing that they put this in the game. I guess this is a good way to promote it. But at the same time, like. This is basically what Warriors is going to be like. You you beating down a, bu a bunch of mindless enemies for like coins and stuff. Yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Glad it's in the game.